Hi, Tim, thanks. Bakersfield City Attorney Alan Tandy is being investigated for an alleged assault. Officials say the other person involved is one of his assistants. 23 ABC's Chris Ornelas is live tonight at the City Ice Arena with what he has learned today. Chris? Well, Todd, because this is still an ongoing investigation, we don't know all of the information about what happened. But we do know that it happened here at the City Ice Arena on Sunday. And 23 ABC has also learned that there is security camera footage of the incident. Now, the district attorney is investigating. I was contacted Monday morning by the chief of police who indicated that there was an incident this weekend at the Bakersfield Ice Sports Arena involving city manager Tandy and um, another city employee, Chris Hewat. City manager Alan Tandy is facing an allegation that he assaulted one of his assistants, Chris Hewat. Tandy is the highest ranking non elected official in the city government and is responsible for the day to day operations of the city. The incident was reported to Bakersfield police, but it would be a conflict of interest for them to investigate because Tandy oversees BPD. It would be in the best interest of the city and all concerned that either the sheriff or the district attorney's office. Uh, Pick it up from here. The city attorney says there was a quote reportable injury, but wouldn't elaborate what that was. It apparently happened while the two were at the arena playing in an adult league hockey game, but it's not clear if a hockey stick was used. As I understand it, it's a it's an off-duty league that you know some city staff members play hockey in. Tandy is currently undergoing his annual performance review by the city council. Many would say that the timing of this is unfortunate, but yes, he had the first part of his performance evaluation at the last meeting and it's my understanding that that's been continued to the June 25th meeting. Uh, the city attorney says that Tandy has not been put on any kind of leave while this investigation is completed. Now 23 ABC has filed a public records request for a copy of that video footage. Back to you.